Okay, I'm gonna... Whoop. Okay, we are back again to the FOF 332, and all the chocolate is still accounted for. No worries, okay? We're gonna sew heavy grade denim now, and not just one or two layers. We're gonna go through a total of 10 layers of this material. We're starting with two. I'm gonna go ahead and fold it once to get us up to four. Again, we're up to six. Now we're up to eight. And one more time, we're all the way up to 10. I didn't fold it perfectly, but you get the idea. And if I turn it to the side, look at what 10 layers of heavy grade denim actually looks like. That is ridiculous. If you tried this on a contemporary machine, even many vintage machines, you might have parts flying all over the place. But you know what? I went through this machine myself and it sews like this and can sew like this every single day. Follow me down to the needle and see what I mean. Again, we're looking at a total of 10 layers of heavy grade denim. And look at as well, there's still room underneath that presser foot. All right, presser foot down. And here we go with 10 layers of heavy grade jean fabric. All right, did you blink? You're going to have to watch the video again then because this machine just gets the job done so quick, so easy, and at the same time going through that much material produces what I would consider to be a perfect stitch. Let me turn it like this as well and pull it back for the camera so you can see with your own eyes just how gorgeous that top stitch in fact is. Look at that. You know what? There are people that dream of a stitch that good and certainly it would be a dream going through this many layers of denim for most machines. Look at from the side as well. And then look at that lock-in stitch. You know what? When you go through material this thick, there can be distortion on that lock-in. That is absolutely a perfect lock-in stitch. You know what? This machine is all about heavy-duty sewing.